Kathy Raley Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined with Kathy Raley, head coach of the women's lacrosse team. And coach, you guys go out last week at the first win of the year at McDaniel. How important was that win for you guys, getting that one done early and filling the net with 16 goals? It was really important for us to see that we could score that many goals. You know, we've struggled in the past two years with goal scoring. And to see us step out in game two, have that kind of ball movement, have that kind of fast break, um, a wherewithal was so great to see. You know, we, we put the game out of reach early. We were able to play everybody, which – at game two of the season, you, that doesn't happen very often because I don't schedule easy mm-hmm. games. So um, playing everybody was was huge. I mean, we had we have girls that uh, that we're seeing some time that I don't think that they expected to this early in the season. You talk about scheduling yeah. those tough opponents early in the season. <laughs> Another tough opponent in Gettysburg, number six team in the country at that point. What were some of the positive things that you saw in that game that you guys get an opportunity to improve on this week? Well, I think some of the positive things are that we had moments of great defense. Um, Where it went wrong was our great defense turned into really kind of poor clearing, um, and then we were just playing defense again. So I think you can't win a game when you're playing 75% defensive and 25% time-wise on the offensive end. So I think the, the really positive things were I think we had a decent game plan heading into Gettysburg. I just think their depth and uh, their fresh legs really wore us down uh, as the game went on. Yeah. Offensively, I think that's the positive things that we saw. You know, again, um, Olivia and Brady were strong going to goal. Uh, they didn't finish as well as they had finished in the first two games, but I think I'm really liking what I'm seeing with them. We were very stunted defensively. I mean, uh, excuse me, stunted offensively, though, which was remnants of last year. We're going to address that this week and uh, get ourselves ready for Montclair. Yeah, speaking of Montclair, what are the things uh, that you guys are going to be looking for in that game uh, as far as what you just touched on and improving on? Montclair is always very athletic. They're very athletic, very aggressive, very fast. Um I think we're going to have a leg up in the fast department this year, which we can't always say. We're so very, very quick. I think our defense is starting to really feel some really good opportunities to be more aggressive than they have been in the years past. Um, we went for a lot of things in Gettysburg that I, you know, I could probably could have called back the defense and keep it, uh, kept the game a little closer in score, but I wasn't interested in – if it was going to be a loss, a loss is a loss, whether it's 16 to 6 or 10 to 6. Um, I wanted us to start to go for things and try to get the ball back and see what we could do with it. Mm-hmm. Montclair, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go at them and, and really make them work hard to score goals. Offensively, we have to step up our playmaking. We have to step up our, our uh, confidence in going to goal and how we go to goal. These girls are going to have to work on some moves this week. Well, Coach, we appreciate your time this Great. week and every week, mm-hmm. and uh, we wish you the best of luck on Saturday Thanks, against Joe. Montclair. I appreciate it. She's Kathy Raley. I'm Joe Waba. This has been the Kathy Raley Show.